Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A man is reading a book in a park. B. Two people are sitting on a bench in a garden. C. A group of people is attending a business meeting. D. Several people are jogging along the beach. The correct answer is C. A group of people is attending a business meeting. Number 2. A. A flight is being announced at the boarding gate. B. People are attending a presentation in an airport lounge. C. Passengers are getting their luggage from the carousel. D. A group of tourists is waiting at a bus stop. The correct answer is B. People are attending a presentation in an airport lounge. Number 3. A. A group of workers is preparing for a conference. B. A woman is giving a presentation in a boardroom. C. A student is taking a phone call in a classroom. D. People are attending a business meeting. The correct answer is C. A student is taking a phone call in a classroom. Number 4. A. A woman is sitting on a bench using her phone in a park. B. A group of people is exercising in a park. C. A family is having a picnic at a park. D. A man is preparing a presentation for a meeting. The correct answer is A. A woman is sitting on a bench using her phone in a park. Number 5. A. A woman is reading a book at a restaurant. B. People are waiting in line to order food. C. A waiter is serving drinks to a group of people. D. A waiter is assisting a customer with her laptop. The correct answer is D. A waiter is assisting a customer with her laptop. Number 6. A. Two people are discussing a presentation in an office. B. Two people are cooking in a kitchen. C. A group of people is walking through a park. D. Several workers are fixing a road. The correct answer is A. Two people are discussing a presentation in an office. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Did you finish the report from Mr. Thompson? A. No, I didn't go skiing. B. I will complete it by tomorrow. C. The presentation is at 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. I will complete it by tomorrow. Number 2. Where did you put the new files? A. Yes, I have. B. On your desk. C. She likes the new policy. The correct answer is B. On your desk. Number 3. Who is presenting at the meeting? A. In conference room A. B. About 30 minutes. C. Mr. Lee from marketing. The correct answer is C. Mr. Lee from Marketing. Number 4. Is the office open on weekends? A. Yes, from 9 to 5. B. No, it's closed. C. Only on Saturdays. The correct answer is A. Yes, from 9 to 5. Number 5. Where can I find the annual report? A. I'll prepare it soon. B. No, it's not available. C. In the company intranet. The correct answer is C. 
in the company intranet. Number six. What's the main topic of the seminar? A. Yes, I will attend. B. It's about digital marketing. C. I'm attending another seminar. The correct answer is B. It's about digital marketing. Number seven. Is the printer working now? A. The printer is in the office. B. No, we need to call the technician. C. Yes, it has been fixed. The correct answer is C. Yes, it has been fixed. Number eight. Have you seen my phone? A. The store closes at 8. B. We'll have pizza. C. I think it's on your desk. The correct answer is C. I think it's on your desk. Number 9. Did you complete the project? A. Please send the files. B. It's due next week. C. Yes, I finished it yesterday. The correct answer is C. Yes, I finished it yesterday. Number 10. Who's responsible for the project? A. It's John's responsibility. B. No, it was postponed. C. Yes, it's going well. The correct answer is A. It's John's responsibility. Number 11. How can I get to the conference room? A. It starts at 10 a.m. B. No, I haven't attended the conference. C. Take the elevator to the third floor. The correct answer is C. Take the elevator to the third floor. Number 12. Did the package arrive on time? A. Yes, it was delivered this morning. B. I haven't checked my email yet. C. Sure, I can help you with that. The correct answer is A. Yes, it was delivered this morning. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Can you send me the finalized report by the end of the day? Sure. I'm currently wrapping up the last section. Great. I'll review it first thing tomorrow morning. When will the man review the report? A. Today. B. Tomorrow morning. C. Tonight. The correct answer is... B. Tomorrow morning. Number 2. There's a client call scheduled for tomorrow at 4 p.m. Can you join? I have a meeting at that time. Can we reschedule? I'll check with the client and let you know. Thanks. I appreciate it. Why can't the man join the client call? A. He's on vacation. B. He forgot. C. He has another meeting. The correct answer is... C. He has another meeting. Number 3. Can you join the conference call at 10 a.m.? I can't. I have a dentist appointment then. How about 11 a.m.? That's fine. I'll reschedule it for 11 a.m. Appreciate it. Thank you. When will the conference call take place? A. At 10 a.m. B. At 11 a.m. C. At 9 a.m. The correct answer is... B. At 11 a.m. Number 4. Have you completed the client feedback survey? Not yet. I'm planning to do it today after lunch. Make sure to submit it by end of day. Will do. Thanks for reminding me. When will the man complete the survey? A. Tomorrow. B. Next week. C. Today. The correct answer is... C. Today. Number 5. Who is presenting the sales report tomorrow? I believe John is handling it. Good to know. I'll prepare the slides for him. Thanks. He appreciates your help. Who is preparing the slides for the sales report presentation? A. Woman. B. Another colleague. C. John.
The correct answer is A. Woman. Number six. Are you available to review the monthly report today? Yes, I can do it after lunch. Perfect. I'll bring the documents to your office. Great. See you then. When will the man bring the documents? A. This evening. B. After breakfast. C. After lunch. The correct answer is C. After lunch. Number seven. I need to reschedule our meeting. Are you free at 4 p.m. instead? Let me check. Yes, 4 p.m. works. Perfect. I'll send a new invite. Thanks. What time will the rescheduled meeting be? A. At 4 p.m. B. At 5 p.m. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is A. At 4 p.m. Number 8. Can we reschedule our lunch meeting? Something urgent came up? No problem. How about tomorrow at the same time? That works. I'll see you then. Perfect. I'll update our calendar. When will the rescheduled meeting take place? A. Tomorrow. B. Next week. C. Today. The correct answer is A. Tomorrow. Number 9. I received a call from a client who is unhappy with our service. Oh no, what happened? There was a miscommunication about their order. I'll schedule a call to resolve it. What is the woman planning to do? A. Ignore the issue. B. Schedule a call. C. Offer a discount. The correct answer is B. Schedule a call. Number 10. When will the new software update be released? We are scheduled to release it next Monday. That's great. Will there be a training session? Yes, there will be a session on Tuesday morning. When is the software update scheduled to be released? A. Next Monday. B. Next Wednesday. C. Next Friday. The correct answer is A. Next Monday. Number 11. I had a look at your proposal for the new project. It looks promising. Thank you. Do you have any feedback or suggestions? Just a few minor changes. I'll send you an email with the details. Great. I'll review them and update the proposal. What will the woman do next? A. Send an email. B. Schedule a meeting. C. Make changes to the proposal. The correct answer is A. Send an email. Number 12. I noticed some discrepancies in last month's expense report. Oh, can you provide more details? Sure, I'll pull up the report and point them out to you. Thank you. Let's address this immediately. What did the man notice? A. Discrepancies in the expense report. B. A decrease in revenue. C. An increase in sales. The correct answer is A. Discrepancies in the expense report. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Thank you for choosing Crest Realty. Our team is dedicated to helping you find your perfect home. Please remember to review the listings carefully and don't hesitate to ask us any questions. We aim to make your home buying experience as smooth as possible. What should potential home buyers do? A. Move in quickly. B. Arrange a visit immediately. C. Review the listings carefully. The correct answer is B. Review the listings carefully. Number 2. Thank you for joining today's online safety workshop. We will cover the basics of creating strong passwords, identifying phishing scams, and securing your personal information online. If you have any questions, feel free to type them in the chat. What is the primary focus of today's workshop? A. Online safety. B. Basic coding. C. Digital marketing. The 
The correct answer is B. Online safety. Number three. Attention all passengers. The next train to downtown will be departing from platform three in 10 minutes. Please have your tickets ready for inspection. For your safety, stay behind the yellow line and watch your step while boarding. If you have any questions, our staff at the information desk is here to help. Which platform will the next train to downtown depart from? A. Platform 3. B. Platform 1. C. Platform 5. The correct answer is A. Platform 3. Number 4. Good morning. Our annual company retreat starts today. We'll have team building activities, workshops, and networking sessions. Breakfast will be served at 8 a.m., and the first session begins at 9 a.m. Please make sure you have your name badges at all times. What time does the first session begin? A. 8 a.m. B. 9 a.m. C. 10 a.m. The correct answer is B. 9 a.m. Number 5. Attention, all fitness enthusiasts. Our gym is launching a new series of workout classes starting next week. Classes will include yoga, Pilates, and high-intensity interval training. Sign up today to secure your spot and take advantage of our early bird discount. What types of classes will the gym offer? A. Weightlifting and swimming. B. Yoga. Pilates and high intensity interval training. C. Zumba and cycling. The correct answer is C. Yoga, Pilates, and high intensity interval training. Number 6. Join us tomorrow at the downtown plaza for a spectacular farmer's market. Enjoy fresh produce artisanal breads, and handcrafted goods from local vendors. The market opens at 9 a.m. and runs until 2 p.m. Don't miss our live music performances starting at 11 a.m. Come support the community and enjoy a wonderful day out. What time do the live music performances start? A. 2 p.m. B. 11 a.m. C. 9 a.m. The correct answer is B. 11 a.m. Number 7. Our new company policy includes flexible work hours to better accommodate our employees' diverse needs. This change is aimed at increasing productivity and job satisfaction. Employees can now choose their start and end times within a set range. Please check the detailed guidelines on the intranet. What is the main goal of the new company policy? A to increase productivity and job satisfaction. B. To monitor employee hours more strictly. C. To reduce office space. The correct answer is B. To increase productivity and job satisfaction. Number 8. Our community center is expanding its fitness class schedule to include evening sessions. Classes will cover various activities like yoga, Pilates, and Zumba. Registration is now open, and members are encouraged to sign up early as spots are limited. What type of classes are newly included in the evening sessions? A. Cooking. B. Language learning. C. Yoga. The correct answer is A. Yoga. Number 9. Please ensure to attend the orientation session on Monday morning at 9 a.m. in the main hall. This session will provide you with important information about the campus and resources available to students. Attendance is mandatory for all freshmen. When and where is the orientation session? A. Wednesday morning at 9 a.m. in the main hall. B. Monday morning at 9 a.m. in the main hall. C. Tuesday afternoon at 2 p.m. in room 101. The correct answer is A. Monday morning at 9 a.m. in the main hall. Number 10. Hello everyone, welcome to our annual charity fundraiser. 
We're thrilled to have so many generous people here today. All proceeds from today's event will be going to local schools to support educational programmes. Don't forget to check out the silent auction, which closes at 3 p.m. Where do the proceeds from the event go? A. To local schools. B. To animal shelters. C. To hospitals. The correct answer is B. To local schools. Number 11. Attention shoppers. Our summer sale starts today. All clothing items are 20% off, and select electronics are up to 50% off. Don't miss our special promotions happening throughout the day. Visit our customer service desk for more details. What is the discount on clothing items? A. 20%. B. 30%. C. 10%. The correct answer is C. 20%. Number 12. We are delighted to have you at our company's annual meeting. This year, we will discuss the major milestones achieved and our future plans. After the presentations, there will be a Q&A session followed by a networking lunch at 12.30 p.m. When will the networking lunch take place? A. At 1 p.m. B. At 12.30 p.m. C. At 11 a.m. The correct answer is C. At 12.30 p.m. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush. Just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, she. In the office when you called. A, has worked. B, was working. C, works. D, will work. The correct answer is. B, was working. Number two, the package has. Arrived. A. Already. B. Yet. C. Any more. D. Still. The correct answer is A. Already. Number three. The building was constructed. The late 90s. A. In. B. At. C. On. D. By. The correct answer is A. In. Number four. They are thinking about a new branch. A. Open. B. To open. C. Opens. D. Opening. The correct answer is D. Opening. Number five. She is fluent. Three languages. A. In, B, for, C, on, D, with. The correct answer is A, in. Number six, the team. On this project since last year. A, will work. B, worked. C, has been working. D, is working. The correct answer is C. Has been working. Number seven. They are interested. Expanding their business. A. In. B. Two. C. Four. D. At. The correct answer is A. In. Number eight. I am responsible. Preparing the monthly reports. A. With. B. For. C. In. D. On. The correct answer is B. For. Number 9. She. 
The meeting when the phone rang. A. Is attending. B. Was attending. C. Attended. D. Will attend. The correct answer is B. Was attending. Number 10. This machine is reliable than the older one. A. Less. B. Least. C. More. D. Most. The correct answer is C. More. Number 11. They will have the new system by next month. A. Installed. B. Installs. C. Installing. D. Install. The correct answer is A. Installed. Number 12. If he the deadline, he will get a bonus. A. Meets. B. Meeting. C. Met. D. Meet. The correct answer is A. Meets. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. We are currently experiencing some technical issues with our server. Our IT team is working to Ajizhimaji them as soon as possible. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. A. Resolved. B. Resolved. C. Resolving. D. Resolution. The correct answer is a. Resolve. Number 2. Please find the attached document for your A. Reviews. B. Reviewer. C. Review. D. Reviewing. The correct answer is C. Review. Number 3. Dear customers, our new product line has been and is available on our website. We invite you to check it out and offer any feedback. Best regards, marketing team. A. Launched. B. Launches. C. Launch. D. Launching. The correct answer is A. Launched. Number 4. Dear patrons, Due to the upcoming holiday, our business hours will be adjusted. We see me state. You two, check our website for the updated schedule. A. Urgible. B. Urged. C. Urging. D. Urge. The correct answer is D. Urge. Number 5. Thank you for purchasing our product. Your order will be shipped. At, you will receive a tracking number soon. A. Shorten. B. Shorting. C. Short. D. Shortly. The correct answer is D. Shortly. Number 6. This memo is to inform all employees that the office will be closed. A. On Friday. B. By Friday. C. In Friday. D. At Friday. The correct answer is A. On Friday. And finally, Part 7. Reading. Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear Valued Customers, We are pleased to announce that our new online booking system is now live. This system will allow for easier and faster appointment scheduling. Try it today by visiting our website. Best regards, customer support team. What is being announced in this message? A. An on-site event. B. A discount on services. C. A new online booking system. The correct answer is C. A new online booking system. Number 2. Dear team, please be reminded that the deadline for submitting the quarterly financial reports is approaching. 
All reports must be submitted to the Finance Department by 5 p.m. on Friday, March 30th. Late submissions will not be accepted. Thank you for your cooperation. When is the submission deadline for the financial reports? A. March 30th. B. April 1st. C. March 29th. The correct answer is A. March 30th. Number 3. Dear subscribers, we are thrilled to introduce our latest premium feature for an enhanced user experience. Starting next week, you will have access to exclusive content and advanced functionalities by upgrading your subscription. Stay tuned for more updates. Sincerely, the team. What is being introduced in this announcement? A. A price increase. B. A premium feature. C. A new customer support line. The correct answer is B. A free trial period. Number 4. Dear customers, starting from next month, all our branches will open an hour earlier on weekdays. The new opening time will be 8 a.m. This change is aimed at providing better service and accommodating the needs of our customers. Thank you for your continued support. What is the new opening time on weekdays? A. 7 a.m. B. 9 a.m. C. 8 a.m. The correct answer is C. 8 a.m. Number 5. Due to scheduled software upgrades, the company network will be offline on Saturday, February 10th, from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. Please ensure that all necessary work is saved and completed before the downtime. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. When will the network be offline? A. February 10th, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. B. February 10th, 10 p.m. 2 a.m. C. February 11th, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. The correct answer is B. February 10th, 10 p.m. 2 a.m. Number 6. Attention. The fitness center will be closed for renovations starting this Monday and will reopen next Friday. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause and thank you for your patience. Regards, management. What is the reason for the closure of the fitness center? A. It is relocating. B. It is being renovated. C. It is permanently closing. The correct answer is B. It is being renovated. Number 7. Attention shoppers. We are holding our annual clearance sale starting next Monday. Expect significant discounts on all items storewide. Don't miss out on these amazing deals. When does the clearance sale begin? A. This Friday. B. This Monday. C. Next Monday. The correct answer is C. Next Monday. Number 8. Please note that our restaurant will be closed from June 1st to June 5th for renovations. During this period, our other branch located at 45 Elm Street will remain open. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. Why will the restaurant be closed? A. For inventory check. B. For renovations. C. For holiday. The correct answer is B. For renovations. Number 9. Effective immediately, parking regulations in the employee lot have changed. Employees must now display a valid parking permit in their vehicles at all times. Failure to comply with this new rule may result in parking fines or towing at the owner's expense. What should employees do to comply with the new parking regulations? A. Pay a parking fee. B. Park only in visitor spots. C. Display a valid parking permit. The correct answer is C. Display a valid parking permit. Number 10. Attention all employees. Our annual team building retreat will take place on Friday, October 22nd at Lakewood Park. 
please make arrangements to be present from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Lunch and beverages will be provided. For any questions, contact Human Resources. What is the main purpose of the notice? A. To announce a team building retreat. B. To schedule a meeting. C. To inform about a new policy. The correct answer is A. To announce a team building retreat. Number 11. Notice The parking lot will be resurfaced on Monday and Tuesday between 8 a.m. and 6 p.m. Please park your vehicles in the overflow lot during these hours. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause maintenance department. Where should vehicles be parked during the resurfacing work? A. In the overflow lot. B. In the main lot. C. On the street. The correct answer is A. In the overflow lot. Number 12. Attention subscribers. We are pleased to announce the launch of our new mobile app. Starting next Monday, you can download the app to access exclusive content, easy navigation, and personalized notifications. Don't miss out on this enhanced experience. Download it from the App Store or Google Play. Cheers, the development team. What is the main topic of this announcement? A. The discontinuation of a service. B. The launch of a new mobile app. C. A scheduled maintenance update. The correct answer is B. The launch of a new mobile app. Number 13. Dear students, the library will be closed this weekend for renovation work. Please ensure to borrow or return any books by Friday evening. The library will resume normal operations on Monday. Thank you for your understanding. Library management. What is the main purpose of this message? A. To advertise a new book. B. To announce new library hours. C. To inform about the library's temporary closure. The correct answer is C. To inform about the library's temporary closure. Number 14. Dear colleagues, the company's annual holiday party will take place on December 20th at 6 p.m. in the Grand Ballroom. Please RSVP by December 10th. We hope to see you there. Cheers, Event Planning Committee. I'm seeing Nate Faints. By when should you RSVP? A. December 5th. B. December 15th. C. December 10th. The correct answer is C. December 10th. Number 15. Dear residents, annual maintenance work on the community pool will commence next Monday and is anticipated to last one week. Please plan accordingly and avoid the pool area during this period. Thank you for your cooperation. What is being announced? A. An upcoming community event. B. Maintenance work on the community pool. C. Introduction of new safety rules. The correct answer is B. A change in pool operating hours. Number 16. 2. All staff. Subject, fire drill. Notification, there will be a fire drill next Wednesday at 2 p.m. Please familiarize yourself with the evacuation routes and assembly points. Your participation is mandatory, safety officer. When is the scheduled fire drill? A. Friday afternoon. B. Next Wednesday at 2 p.m. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is B. Next Monday at noon. Number 17. Attention passengers. Due to extreme weather conditions, Flight 123 to New York has been delayed by three hours. The new departure time is 6 p.m. We advise passengers to stay updated for further announcements. We apologize for the inconvenience caused. What is the new departure time for Flight 1023? A. 9 p.m. B. 6 p.m. C. 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. 6 p.m. Number 18. Dear subscriber, 
we are thrilled to introduce our new line of eco-friendly products, available starting next week. These products are made from sustainable materials and reflect our commitment to the environment. Stay tuned for exclusive discounts for our loyal customers. Best Green Tech Team. What is the announcement about? A. A change in company policy. B. A new line of eco-friendly products. C. An upcoming event. The correct answer is B. A new line of eco-friendly products.